Hello everybody, how is it going? Welcome to another episode of Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord. Guys, it is time that I would say we're gonna go to war again. What we need is we need to find a nice castle that we can besiege ourselves. And for that reason, I think I'm gonna go down here because it's... Oh, 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 oh wait, 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 I saw something. I saw somebody who had a quest mark above his head. Yeah, let's try to get this guy. Oh, that's gonna be so good. Hello, mister. So, I'm Trenton, who are you? Tell me about Neretz's folly, thank you very much, and here we go, I must leave now. Goodbye! That was a nice talk. <laughs> Good that we talked there. Now, I, I wanted to go down here, because there is a chance that I get this castle, and um, it's pretty close to the other castle, so it is... Holy cow. Uh, it is actually quite good to defend. Is that what I see? Is that actually 89 looters roaming around the countryside here? What the actual hell? I wanna get these guys. It's gonna give us so much experience. Alright, so this is a good hill to defend. I'm gonna send the footman here. Shield wall. Uh, give me a sec. Second one are going over there. Loose formation and the horses. Coming with me. Actually, let's put the footman a little bit more up front. Holy cow, look at all these looters who are hopefully coming now. Alright, let's move here. And I think this is pretty much doable. So, let's see. We have 89 looters. That is so crazy. 89 looters. I'm gonna take the cavalry up here. So, um, that I can send them in the planks. Alright. So, here's the cavalry. We're gonna... Put them right here. Okay. And then I'm gonna... Oh my god. Look at that. Look at all the people. Oh, hello. I need the horses, I think. Yeah, I need the horses now. Here we go. Horses go in. Wreak some havoc, split them up. And in the meantime, I'm gonna see what's going on down there. Holy macaroni. I mean, we got some, we got some, some good stuff happening already. Hey, dude. Sorry, you're dead now. Uh, charge. That's what I wanted to do. So, I sent my footman into charge. And this is, this is glorious. Alright, alright, alright. We got this. We definitely got this. Yeah, looters are going down. And we are winning. Oh, we also lost somebody. I hope it's just a wound. And, um, not a kill there. Alright, here we go. A bit of damage. Couch lands, possible? No, not quite. These looters actually gave me hell. Wow. Wow, I love this battle, and there are still people around. This is so crazy! There are so many! It's today the day of the looter! Uh-oh, let's get out of here. <laughs> They're still fighting. It's admirable, but you are bound to die, since you have wronged the country and your liege. Alright, I think that's it. We actually lost somebody. It was a Batanian horseman, but we get plus one polearm. And a good chunk of upgrades here on our low tier troops. It was really cool. So the horsemen, of course, you know, it's a, it's a bit of a problem. But, gonna upgrade these two, gonna upgrade these two, these three are trained archers now. And these trained archers are now veteran archers and the recruits are gonna be more archers. Cause I need, you guessed it right, more archers. Blandian champion. Alright, nice. Banner knight now. Um, yeah, sure. I want the best archers possible. Alright, so far so good. That was a nice start for this, I would say. And we get a good chunk of loot as well. It's all low tier loot, but in the end, in the end it all comes down to, uh, you know, just getting something so that we can sell and, uh, ooh, okay, stay uh, healthy and wealthy. I'm gonna go to Krotor. He has the best name ever. Really? Krotor? Is that what you're, uh, what you're named? Krotor. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> no questions, man. No question. Uh, we could try to besiege this castle here. Uh, big emphasis on trying, because I know that Krotor is here, and uh, they probably also bring their friends. Alright, we have not that many people around. Let's build an army, alright? Let's see if there are some people who are willing to join us. So if we create an army now, we see that everybody is kind of busy right now. But Semnon brings a lot of people. What does Semnon have? A lot of volunteers. 40 people that we cannot really count on. But the other guys are okay. 
Cost us 25 influence. Or we take Inghalter. He brings just a way bigger host. I like that idea. That's 60 recruits. 47 volunteers. All of them are gonna die quite quickly, but we need some meat shields. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is a good idea. Uh, one day and 16 hours. Oh my god, this is kind of... Hmm, kind of a long time that we have to wait. You know what? I'll take both. I cannot sustain both for long enough. But maybe we don't need to sustain ourselves for long enough. Maybe we just take this castle and then we go. Alright. Here we go. We're gonna start besieging the castle and hopefully the cavalry will arrive in time. Alright, let's check this out, guys. Um, the big thing that I want is probably... I probably want to build a ram. Although, these guys seem to have a castle that has a... Um, like a big keep in front, like like these towers, and they probably have murder holes and double gates, so, hmm, going through there is gonna be really hard. Let's build two of the siege towers, I think. Yeah, and the ram. Alright. So first of all, we have to build the camp. And worst case scenario is we just gain some, uh, what is it called, engineering skills here, and then we go again. Because people are coming to help. These guys are just mountain bandits, that's good. There's Semnon. Oh, that's so good. Hey, Semnon. Good to see you, man. This will give us some resilience against getting uh, counter-attacked. That's beautiful. There's a caravan. Again, nothing crazy. Alright. So, I'm gonna wait for the other guy. He brings, uh, Inghalter. He brings 178 people. But we are no longer enemies. What are you talking about? I just built an army. What? what? No! No! Um, I guess we're gonna go north then. <laughs> to Sturgia and beyond. Come on, my people. Let's go ahead and uh, wreak some havoc. Oh, that was the worst. That was the worst timing, guys. The absolute worst timing. I was ready to take this castle. All right. Uh, here's Inghalter. That's good. Mm, I guess we're gonna seek some trouble in the north then. <laughs> Oh my god, what a coincidence. Oh, by the way, um, I should probably take a look at my character, because there might be something that I can upgrade. There is something I can upgrade. Your soldiers deal 5% more damage in simulations. I like that. It's only 5%, but it's 5%. Also, we need to try in our, our thing here, our, our character a little bit more. Maybe just putting a bit of emphasis on one-handed and two-handed, because it's easy to achieve in the lower levels. Um, just, you know, just farming some of the skill points. Crossbow, yeah, that's not a thing. Throwing weapons is also pretty low. Smithing is a thing that we can do. Mm, scouting. How do you scout, by the way? Spot tracks and hideouts. Travel through difficult terrain. Yeah, but we are maxed out on this already, so we cannot even get higher. Unless we dump some skill points into this. Um, charm is already maxed out. Leadership. Maintain high morale. Uh, assemble and lead armies. That's what I'm doing currently, right now. Also, I'm not really... Actually, I have a pretty good morale. Yeah, my food variety is high, and we are at 84. So, we, we should actually train leadership passively. That should be a thing that we can do. Alright, let's, um, 228 men. Let's, uh, get something. I don't know, 228 is quite a lot. I wanna check out the other castle, maybe it's easier to take. And then we're gonna take the easier one, taking less casualties. And, yeah, Cranier Castle has only 73 defenders. So, we can take that easily, absolutely easily. Um, besiege the castle here. I'm doing the same thing, building some siege weapons. So we will take less casualties from this castle, and then we're gonna take the other one as well, and then the army will probably disband anyway. But hey, let's see how this goes. Big question. Uh, four more people I have to talk to. Good. Our leadership skill is now at 41. And there is a big, like a huge army coming around. Will they attack us? Oh yeah, they will. Ah! Can't do it. Can I? What do you have? Maybe I can. They just have the benefit of, you know, numbers. Uh, they have a lot of recruits, but so do I. 156 recruits on the Sturgeon side, and... We have 67 Imperial recruits. If I can force them in open field battle... Is that a thing? I should run, honestly. No, I can now lead the assault. Right? And then we're gonna have we we're gonna have a castle.
Maybe it's better to just send the troops here. Yeah, I'll send the troops. I'm not fighting myself because in... Um, oh my god, we lost a lot of people. Uh, but what I wanted to say is in the... Um, in the actual fight, um, if you don't have any any kind of siege weapons, the, the people are really bad with pathfinding and so on, and they don't know where to go, and the, all of the archers will just wreck us. However, they wrecked us anyway. Uh, our casualties are 27 in Trenton's party. Okay, but we got the castle. We got a bunch of prisoners. Yes, yes, yes. We got a bunch of... Okay, some stuff here. Maybe this is where we just run. Grenier Castle has fallen. Yeah, that's the good news. The bad news is that they are still a huge host. And, um... I'm running. Okay, so... Oh my god, we got what we came for. Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. Here's the thing. Uh, I can definitely deal with 200 people. If they are mostly recruits. Uh, maybe we are getting there. Maybe we are just going for a nice, a nice open field fight. 82 recruits. Uh, battalion volunteers, 37 we bring? I mean, my troops are good, but my troops are also wounded. Mm, this might be doable, but it might not be doable at the same time. We're gonna stay in the area. My goal right now is to quickly, <laughs> as quickly as possible at the very least, quickly heal. Hi! Can I enter the castle? Thank you. Alright, so we're gonna wait here for some time because it heals us faster. All right, and yeah, we're gonna wait a little longer. It's fine. It's fine. Cool thing is, we actually built an outpost for our people, and we have now three hundred defenders in this one. Everybody's like, "Oh my god, yeah, oh, this is cool. We have a castle. Let's just wait here for a while because there are enemies out there. There are a lot of them, and they are nasty and angry, and and so on." So, for how long do we wait here? Still fifteen wounded, seventeen wounded, nine wounded. All right. So this is where we go. And there's the armory. I think we can do it. I want to. I really want to, guys. Let, let's do it. Uh, but not in the village. I need to make use of my of my advantage with my arrows. Here we go. Alright, so we have an even fight. That's good. We can also try to trick them into switching sides again. Honestly, let's do that. They have like three... No, wait, that's my people. Uh, they have two, um, two, you know host there to lords. Maybe we can talk about that. What are you offering? Oh, I can barter here. Let Trenton go. Oh, no, wait, they are attacking me. Never mind. Never mind. So we gotta attack. It's fine. But this time I'm gonna command my own troops. Um, sure. Can I even move them around? I cannot. So, what is our strength in, in terms of numbers on archers? Actually put them here. Oh wow, we have none. We have none. <laughs> Alright. So all we have is footmen. Our archers are completely done. Oh, here come the cavalry. Boss archers. Fine. What's your battle plan, boys? Alright, I'm gonna couch lands and we're gonna try to get the enemy's cavalry down. Oh, please! Come on! I got a horse, and horse is down. Give him hell, guys. And then again, terrain, my biggest enemy. Actually, follow me, guys. It is important that we pull back. Let the infantry crash against our infantry. Let the archers do their archer work. It's kind of working, and we're gonna go into their flanks. Yeah. Alright, here we are, guys. We're in the fight. I really hope that my cavalry can just blow them apart from, uh, you know, different angles here. Ugh! Get wrecked, recruits. Got him. And another one. Come on, get these archers down. Yeah, woodsmen. Be gone. Oh, there's a. Yeah, let's go for the cavalry again. Aha! 60 damage. And he's down. They have a lot of them. It's crazy. They have so many. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Ah, 700 damage to the horse. <laughs> I think we can easily do that. It's looking very good. All 
Alright. So everybody, move here again. I want a nice formation. And currently we are super duper spread out. So everybody is regrouping. I'm gonna send the horses to attack. Because I still need to completely mess up their formation. While my oh wow, while my infantry is kind of waiting. It's good. Got him. Infantry move in now. I think this is where we attack again. Oh what? Seven damage. I'm taking you down! That was the Lord! Alright, we got the Lord. That's good. Gotcha! No, didn't get you! Aha, gotcha! He's not dead though. What are you fighting here, buddies? Just kill him! Like that! Easy! Just like that! Oh, this is working! We're gonna have some casualties on our side. But, we're gonna get so much renown. This is so weird, you know? Just using your army as a resource and your, your permanent progression is, is, is army size. So it's always getting more people, losing people, getting more people, losing people, getting even more people, and then losing people again. This is not an RPG, really, where you just, where, like, you know, you keep every character alive. We're just managing resources here. Oh, I'm so happy with the lands. This is so cool. I think we got it. We won the battle. Enemies are fleeing. It was glorious, people. It was so glorious. Oh my god, the whole empire will talk about the, the, the heroic deeds of this battle. Trent and Carantino strikes again. Cool. So, we still lost 18 people in our party. Uh, a bunch of people in the other part. No, wait, this is our party. 13 in our party. Oh, it's okay. We gain three pole arm proficiency. We get plus one tactics, plus one riding. Hell yeah. And of course, we get some prisoners. Uh, yeah, you're free to go. I'm usually doing that. Mm. So, the first thing to do. Uh, we're gonna recruit from our... Ooh, that's good. Uh, from our um, prisoners, because I need to fill up the ranks with more people. Actually, that's a pretty good fill-up here. Alright. And then we're gonna take everything else. Whoop. Okay. And we are over limit, I know. We get some horses here, that's pretty cool. I love it. What about braces? What are we running in terms of braces here? These seem to be better. Yeah, that's 18. That's that's good. Have that, man. We also have 11. Uh, is the shield better? I mean, this here is a very good riding shield. The shield has better stats, that's definitely true, but does it have a better hitbox? Not really. No. No, 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 no. Let's go ahead and give him his big shield back. This is also a pretty good shield. Mm, I think it protects the upper body a bit better. Mm, yeah, I think I want to go with that. Alright, have that. That's cool. What about you? Oh, you still have a pretty bad one. Yeah, I know. I should really take care of my outfit of my of my friends here. All right, and that's fine. You got the big one. And then there is Trenton, also with a with a huge reinforced oak and kite shield. All right. So of course we take everything, and we are done. Pretty good fight, guys. I'm very proud of you. Now, can we fight 234 people in the castle now? I'd say no. Because we lost so many people. We are down to 153, if, or let's say 162, if everybody is, um, is up and running again. That is not enough, to say the least. Alright. Okay, upgrading. Oh, do I want another light cavalry? No, I think I want swordsmen a bit more. We still have enough cavalry to win most of the field battles anyway. Mm, okay, let me quickly see. Where are you going? The Imperial Footmen are probably... I don't need Spearmen, do I? No. Against enemy cavalry, Spearmen are pretty good. I'm gonna train them into Sword and Shield buddies. Alright. Infantryman. More Footmen. Vlandian Footmen are gonna get uh, trained to... Probably Cavalry. Uh, the Batanians are better Footmen than their Riders. So we're gonna train them in that way. 
Tanyan Volunteer, again here. More Woodrunners, wow. So the troop quality is actually pretty good. Look at all these tier 4, tier 5, tier 3 troops. And then of course we have, we have cavalry, and that's kind of working. Put the champion up there. Alright. But we are highly under our maximum. Okay, so here's what we do. Um, I'm gonna donate some prisoners here, because uh, we cannot have so many anyway. So we go to the dungeon, donate prisoners. That gives me a good standing with the ruling lord here. And we're gonna give them the big ones, because you cannot recruit from tier 4 and 5, as far as I can tell. Still too many. Wow. I want to keep the recruits around. No, actually... No, let's drop him. If I, if I recruit, then I want to recruit higher tier troops already. So you're gonna get that. Oh, we didn't resolve the, the, the bet on the castle, right? So nobody is ruling that? Actually, there's somebody ruling it. You can see there's a banner. Huh. Alright. Anybody here? No. Alright, so the next big thing. Um... We could heal here in the castle. Let's wait here for some time. Maybe we can do it. Um, that is um, approaching the other castle with 200 and more. And we got some influence back. Haha. -ha. So, as soon as we... As we... Um, as we get somebody else in our group here. Uh, it should be possible. All of the people are pretty far away though. Alright, so... Um, I want you. That's 18 influence. I'm just gonna go with the guys who are close by. The closest possible. <sighs> More than two days. Holy crap. It's one day. Okay, how much will it cost us? I think enough. But I think also that these guys are enough to take the castle. Oh, that's everything. Alright. So I just hope that we have enough cohesion for the next two days. So that the people can actually arrive and uh, our army doesn't disband. Ooh, we get steward and leadership. It's beautiful. Just waiting. Just waiting for the people. We only have one wound here. Six wounds on that guy. Three wounds on that guy. Or wounded people on that guy. And yeah, our, um, our cohesion is actually fine. It doesn't change too much. Right? Alright, so we are at full strength. Let's go ahead. And take the castle. Oh, you're already taking it! You're already fighting here. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna help you. Uh, do we send troops? Might be easier. Might be better. I'll attack. I'll attack myself. You know what? Let's go. Question is, are they already in the middle of the fight? Uh, no, it doesn't seem like it. Alright! Come on, boy! Let's go! Um, let's go here. No, actually, let's let's go ahead and flank them. Oh, okay. So I think we have a pretty safe spot here, being able to shoot these archers down. Ideally, I'm getting um, a bow and an arrow upgrade later. That gives us a hundred damage output because that's how much health these um, these militia guys have. So we can one-shot them and we save arrows as a result. Okay. Ah, this is really hard to hit. Let's hit the other guy, or try. Nice headshot, but 89 is not enough, yet again. Cool. Oh, we are making some real progress here. It's like on a shooting- ow, shooting range. But the shooting range where the shooting range actually shoots back. So mobility is key. Yeah, I saw that coming. I'd rather step aside. Okay, and now we are out of ammo, but luckily our enemies... Hello? Ooh, they're giving us something back. <laughs> Alright, here. Yeah. You forgot your arrow. I'm gonna... Oh, I'm gonna give it back to you, I wanna say. Okay. I think... This would have been better if I actually hit. Five more arrows. Got one. Dealt damage. Got another one. 
This guy is kind of scary. Oh, wait, we have another arrow. All right. That's a real good spot that we have here. Gonna take all of these arrows, and we're just gonna shoot them back. Oh, okay, he switched position. Good. A lot of our people are already dying. I wonder why. I mean, of course, they are getting shot by arrows as well. Um, but the, the gate is about to get destroyed, that's good. It's just so funny that a lot of a lot of our, our men are just... You didn't build siege weapons? No towers? I see, I see, I see. So that was our glorious friend here, our glorious leader that we just helped. Who didn't build siege weapons except for... Um, except for a ram. But that's okay, so we are trying to get the ladders online. I'm always saying online. I'm so hung up to this whole mech warrior thing. Where you make your weapons online, sensors online. You know, all systems nominal. I wanna help! See you in hell! Can I have your arrow, please? Can I take it out of your body? I need it. I need to shoot people. It's not possible. Alright! Trent and Carantino. Getting on the ladder. And we're joining the fight. I'm really hoping that I can find one of these arrow bins that are standing around everywhere. So that I can help from the inside here. Let's check out a tower. Maybe maybe we can find an arrow bin here. Oh, who are you? What? Didn't expect somebody to be here anymore. Ow! Yeah, obviously, obviously a lance is not the best weapon to engage in a close quarter combat. But I didn't want to change. It would be cool if you could have two different loadouts. Like a siege loadout and an, uh, an open field battle loadout. By the way, I shot you down. I'll take your, f your arrows as a result. Aha! Here we go. So we got arrows again. Uh, what are we doing with them? We're gonna shoot from here. Of course. Got him! Hey, we actually hit him! Uh, we destroyed him completely! What? That's so cool. That is so cool. We have the best position here. Yeah, you raise your shield. Haha, <laughs> and then uh, take it down in the worst moment. Oh, the reinforcements. They have nothing they can do. Nothing, I say. A uh, bit higher, I guess. Yep. Ah, that was a shield. And now they are gone. There's one more. Okay, so we got five shots left. The good news is that our people are completely destroying these enemies. The gates, at the barricades. Uh, like that. Ah, that was a shield. So, um, wait, wait, wait. There was one more guy, but now he's dead. Yeah, he's completely uh, despawned. Means no more arrows for me, at the very least, not at the moment. And yet again, those enemy. Ah! Oh, where are you? Those enemies don't seem to have any kind of. Oh, oh that's interesting. Ah, uh, that's not good. Uh, any kind of, any kind of bins of arrows here. Let me go back in here. Hello. I'm a bit scared because of the overwhelming might of your troops here. Alright. Down. No, 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 no. Don't you flank me. Uh-uh. Not gonna happen. You stupid spearman. I mean, you're not really stupid. Maybe you are. I don't know. I don't know you. Maybe you're a very nice man. Maybe you're our father having a family. And now I'm killing you. You just, you know, maybe we're just stationed here and this was your last day and you were just about to retire going home. Your wife waiting at home, cooking dinner for you. And now you're dead. I'm sorry. Hmm. I think we got it. We won the battle. And what a glorious battle it was. Yeah, everything worked fine here. Everything worked as expected. Still in it. We still have four enemy troops, four enemy defenders. The question is, where are they? Attack! I'm gonna send a charge order. Maybe that does something. Oh, there's one! Get him, boys! 20 people on one single man. And this is where we win. So we didn't get the best green down here because obviously there was a bigger host that was already attacking and we were just helping out. But the casualties on our side are pretty low, and I'm very happy about that. Cool. Hey, relation increased. Not bad. Oh, turned up just in time, and we get two points of charm.
Alright, we'll take the prisoners, thank you. We're gonna upgrade some troops as well. Here we go. And, ooh, yeah, battalions are better footmen than they are riders. And I need more bowmen. Okay, we'll take the volunteers, we'll take the spearmen. Alright. And then, of course, we're gonna get some loot. That loot is good. Othalame Castle has been taken. I actually want to bet on that, but I don't have enough influence to actually get involved. Oh. And since I lose um, relation with my with my fellow lords, um, if I abstain from the bet, I'm not gonna go for it. Or like, it's not a bet, it's a vote, basically. Let's get that hideout. I mean, since we're here anyway, we might as well just go for it. And I'm very well aware that you can't just go ahead and just take the quest for our clearing the hideout, but I could also just do it, okay? Because I don't want to spend so much time going forth, going back, and then, um, you know, my, my whole army... Uh, cohesion is just gonna get, get completely wrecked. For that reason, I shouldn't even go for the hideout. But it was just around the corner, and I thought it was a good idea. So, let's go ahead, attack here. And... I think we can send in everybody. Come on, guys, charge. Let's go. Let's do it. What? Ah, there we go. 18 damage. I'm... I'm in a, in a very weird range bracket here. Ah, yeah, there we go. 32. Now I hit my own man. Maybe not. There are actually a bunch of people here. You know what? Stay here. Stay here. We're gonna not go all in. Or are we? Definitely want a shield wall. Oh, there's a guy. Oh. Okay, one more. Here we go. Down goes the freebooter. I have pretty good uh, draw speed here. This is what I like about the character. Ow. Alright, got the waka. The waka of bushes, and I'm gonna say charge. You kill? Ow, good shot. Is that the last guy? He might be. Oh, that was the tree. There we go. So, one more person. And it seems like we, we actually lost somebody. Like, the red bar is not full anymore. Oh, interesting. Very, very interesting. Alright. And down they go. Here we go. Cool. See, got true without a wonder I got the last hit on the forest bandit. So, Mr. Bandit Lord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Swaggering here. <laughs> Dude, you have no men. I have the numbers. We don't find duels with brigands either. Guys, don't get shot by arrows. What are you doing here? And we got him. Good. These people, just standing there, uh, Lord, my lord, what shall I do? I am getting shot by arrows, my knee is bleeding. <laughs> uh, we lost an Imperial Archer, that's not so cool. But okay. So, Forest Bandit, should I even take this Forest Bandit? I could, why not? So, getting these guys, peasants? Go away, peasant. I release you into freedom. And we get, we actually get some interesting arrows here. Splintered barbed and just barbed. What's the difference? There is no difference. Just in just in money, just in value. And honestly, they have a good value. Look at that thing. Worn Highland furred cloak is worth thousand four hundred. That's a lot. That's that's a hell of a lot. Uh, it's better than this cape here. Oop, all right. Uh, let's not forget all the stuff here, and we're gonna continue going. Going into the north. Always north. Let's do it. We still have 300 men, and we should make use of them. 100%. So, what we're gonna be doing now is, uh, we're gonna seek some more trouble getting the castle. 72 men? Yeah, this one is mine. Let's do it, guys. Besiege the castle. I command it. Getting that. I wonder if it's better to just build 
um, what's it called? Just build. Yeah, um, build catapults and, and ballista siege weapons like that. I want to check this out. All right. So we're gonna build ballistas because I I do believe that they are good against enemy siege weapons. Well, let's try that. And by the way, they have no food stocks, which means we can try to actually starve them out. I want to see how this goes. I want to play the you know the longer siege. There's a lord coming. No, that's villagers. Never mind. Worst case scenarios, I'm just gonna simulate that because we have an amazing amount of people here. Okay, one of our ballistas is down. Come on, ballista! Wow. No, this is getting wrecked completely. And here come the lords. Okay. Okay. I'll build... Let's say we built, we built a ram first and then we're gonna build a tower. Oh, and they only have what? No, not 15 men. This is the, the villager there. What do they have? I can't see it. Oh, there we go. They have 86 defenders. Weren't they like 70-something before? Interesting. Good news is that we have the leadership. What's, what about our towers? They are getting built already. Perfect. 91. They are actually building more defenders as we stand here. Uh, and yeah, this is uh, a little bit too much now. Um, question is, do I send just the troops? I also want to get some more tactic skills and we are overwhelmingly strong currently. Let's send the troops. Let's do it. Lost a bunch of people, but that's okay. My losses were only 11 in this fight and we get renown as well as morale and influence. <laughs> and a good chunk of prisoners again. Pretty good. So upgrade these boys. More archers, thank you. Uh, Imperial trained infantry. Again, Imperial ones are gonna get to, gonna go to the left. And that is it. Oh wow, Sturgeon Hunters, love it. Italian Raiders, sure. Watchmen? Okay. Clan Warriors. Sturgeon's warrior's son of a gun. Okay. Soldier. Boris Bandit, even. Wait, that was a tier 4 troop. We could hire tier 4 troops. Hmm, interesting. But yeah. Uh, party is, yeah, I know, oversized. My, my prisoners are oversized. Oh, that's okay. Since now, we own that castle. And we got a bit of influence. Yeah, you know what? I can vote for myself here? I don't want to abstain. Oh, Semlon is going to get that. Why can I not bet on myself? Is, wasn't there something, wasn't there an option for, for 20 influence? I thought it was 20, 50, 100, and then 300? Or maybe it was 50, 100, 300. Uh, okay, let's... Hmm. Luchan? What? Alright. Yeah, have fun with the castle, man. Fun with the castle. But here's what we do. I wanted to say we're just gonna get into the castle and then uh, hide there, but you know what's gonna be better? Hunting one of these guys. What's our nominal speed right now? Oh, we are not, uh, We have no cohesion. We are disorganized after the battle. Uh, we might get Auric. Let's see. Just need to get my speed back. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't you dare running. Oh my god, there's a lot. There is a lot of people. I think we can still do it. Oh, they joined. They joined forces. That is actually good because now they might hunt me. And they're also getting... A little bit lower, slower. If these guys join the ranks, it's gonna be devastating now. Oh! No, 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 no. Yeah, they are building bigger armies here. <laughs> Sorry, changed my mind. You know what? I'm fine. You just do you, okay? I, I don't, don't, don't mind me. I'm just here as well, just admiring the landscape of your country. Yes, it's your country. Not long, but yes, it's your country. Let's go. Although, 300, 300, mostly, wow, 163 are recruits. If, here's the thing, if, 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 
If I get enough time to heal, I can take them. And I want them. So I'll get them. Here's what we do. We're gonna take a look at our army. Drop some cohesion, or drop some uh, influence into cohesion. That didn't work. That worked. So we can battle a little bit longer alongside our friends, and then we're gonna stay around. Oh, they bring even more. We cannot outheal their growth. Possibly. Hmm, not good. So what if I have all of the people ready? How many, like, what's our troop strength? Uh, 148 plus 71, that's 219. Possible. Possible. Absolutely possible. But we need, we need help for it. Okay, back to the castle. Because that's a thing that I, ooh. Okay. We're gonna take that fight, I guess. They have a lot of ranged guys, but I think this is doable. Mm, but yeah, we're gonna go back to the castle and seek shelter in the within the walls. This guy is too fast for us, though. So, approach the gates, request entry, and then we're gonna wait here for some time. Could also donate troops, right? Donate prisoners. Okay, a bunch of them ran away. That's okay. So, hire everybody that we can. And then we're done. Wow, this is gonna be interesting. Oh, they're not interested in the castle. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. We're just waiting. Wait for it. We heal faster in castles, therefore. Oh, and there's the big army coming. Okay, so this is where we where we go and leave. And try. Uh, I have the feeling that my people are attacking. Oh yeah, they are. They will. I want them alone, though. That would be optimal. Which means... I could now go in. And then maybe the others are joining us, or, or not. So this is the moment where I just have to make a decision. Do I challenge these guys alone, having half of their troop strength? Or do I wait for the big army to go in first? Again, half of the troop strength. We have to kill extremely efficiently if I want to get something done. I want to do it. Let's, let's go. Oh, okay, so everybody's fighting anyway. I'm Trenton. Hi. But I'm the attacker, which is good. Because, um... I can also try to go for charm skills. Yeah, let's try it. Let's try it once and then we're gonna fight. So, um, you might have heard of my reputation. Oh, you did? Oh, that's nice. Good. So, let's go with 74%. Ragavan is... Uh, Raganvat is not known for keeping his word. Yes, exactly. Oh, this charm is so good. And then we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna maybe convince him that he is switching sides now. And we did. Alright! Alright, you might be correct. Very well, you've convinced me. <laughs> is this a dangerous step? Uh, what do you want? How can I please you? I'm not gonna give you all of that. No, you know what, change my mind. I'm not gonna barter. We have all the people here, as in all the people. And I'm the commander of this army. Ah, let's go. Oh, wait. I'm the commander of my troops. My allied troops are just going anywhere they want. Which is good, because I can, you know, keep my own people around. Warriors! Everyone! Go here. Uh oh. What was that? Sneak attack. It's not that sneaky, actually. I, I, I you could really see that coming. <laughs> I just wanted to set up my warriors and all of a sudden there's cavalry. Alright, he's down. That's good. Uh, that's a lot of it. Man, I want to coordinate my troops real quick. Enemies are coming from there anyway. Okay, so again, all of my people. Move here, please. Okay, this is my... This is gonna be my archer hill. Footman here. I wonder if that works. So we're gonna build a nice phalanx here. Get the archers on the hill. Maybe we move forward even a bit more. Yeah. So this is the bowman. Bowman here. 
And then we're gonna say, uh, God, face the enemy? Yeah. Great. Why are the horses up there? Alright. So we out we got the horses on our side. Is this our is this our infantry? Seems like it. Yeah, you know what? We might as well just crush them. Let's go. Let's just go. One down. Ah, actually, my footmen and my archers did a good job. Let's put the archers here. And the footmen here. Just as a reserve. Wow. Wow. These guys are getting crushed completely. Holy shit. Look at that. I mean, we have the numbers, clearly. We definitely have the numbers. Oh my god. Yeah, guys, run. There's no glory to win here. <laughs> Give me a second. I want to check something. Um, jump. Oh, uh, no, that was too early. Again, jump. Ah, too far away. I want to make this jump skill. Uh, jump shot. Mm-hmm. Not like that, though. Maybe we just kill him. I think we just kill him. Guys, where are you going? Seriously. The fight is on the front line, not in the back line. Yeah, let's, let, let him go. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. We're gonna take some more... <clears throat> Casualties here? I guess not. Charge. That's what I wanted to say. Let's do it. Let's get back into the fight. There are still a lot of enemies to kill here. And especially these archers, they can be really nasty. Oh, there's cavalry. Let's go for it. Got him. Um... Ideally, I want to get a battle scythe later, because that's also considered a pole arm, and we can do slashing damage with it, which is really cool. You just ride in. Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. I want to get out of here. Uh, but yeah, you just ride in, and, and, and just hold out uh, the, the, the scythe on the side, and just cut and reap. This is really good. You also have a broader point of impact. Uh, it's easier to hit things with it. I am kind of not in a good spot. Yeah, the problem is that they still have a lot of people there on the sidelines. And they are completely shooting us. Right, let's get the get the couch lance damage in. Uh, here maybe? Yep. I mean, with a bit of practice, you can actually hit your lance quite well. But sometimes... Sometimes it's a bit awkward. You know, the people make a sidestep, and then all of a sudden you deal, like, zero damage. I'm gonna shoot them. Skill points! Let's get them! Obviously too high. And they're just standing there. I wonder why. Oh, the fight is on. I think this will come with a lot of casualties in, uh, in, in general. I'm just hoping that my people are kind of surviving that. It's an onslaught! See that? Okay, another cavalry. Let's take him. Where are you going, buddies? Ah, oh, you slowed me down! Damn it! Good block. Let's go. Ah, oh, two damage. See, this is what I mean. Sometimes it is so hard to get that javelin or that spear on on the point here. Where I want it. Alright, let's go for the other guys then. That's easy. So many people! I'm losing track! Ah! Ah! But they're running! That's good! I think we won the battle! I really wonder how much renown we're gonna get for that. I mean, we were outnumbering them quite a lot. Because um, our friends were joining us here. See? Alright, another reinforcement wave. Let's get him. Let's 
straight into it. Boom! <laughs> yeah, and this is, again, this is where we, where we just dropped, but it's okay. Is it, though? Wow, a lot of our people are dying now. Come on, we have 64 enemies. We should be able to do that. 12, 7, 4, that's where we win. 3 Renown! Wow. Just wow. Where's my army? Giorgio, Trenton. Trenton lost three people. All right, and we got five skill points. Uh, Galtrimund also got three riding skill points. That's cool. That's cool as hell. Uh, yeah, you're free to go. All right. Anybody else? You're free to go. Come on, I want my charm skill. Nope. <laughs> Increased by six to negative 19. Uh-huh. So this is our standing here. Alrighty, guys. We're gonna recruit some people here. Sturgeon Warriors, not bad. We are still completely over. Are there any recruits? Yeah, we're gonna drop the recruits. And I think we're gonna drop some battalions. I like the... No, these are militia archers. We drop them as well. And then probably a woodsman. These woodsmen, wait, they can be upgraded to pretty good bowmen, right? Yeah, so we're gonna keep them. And we drop one warrior, so we are at exactly the numbers of prisoners that we can hold. Fish harpoon and a cow. Guys, we have a cow now. We need a name for the cow. Suggestions down below in the comments. Now, uh, we also fought a glorious battle. And I would say that was a pretty good progress that we made today. Our character looks solid. Uh, we even get one more point into polearm. That is Lancer. Couch damage increased by 30%. As if we need more of that, honestly. Couch lance damage is so OP already. I think they need to balance these skill points out because... We are dealing way too much damage. Anyway, guys, that has been it for today. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Mountain Blade 2, a banner lord. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.